All right, what is up, guys? This is uh, Super Strong Cheaper One Two Four here, and I'm gonna bring you another review. Okay, so in this video, I'm going to be reviewing DS3 Tool, um, which is base, which is this program where you can use your PS3 controller for available for use on your PC. If that made any sense, I'm not sure. Okay, so um, I'm just gonna show you. So this is the program here. It's called Motion Enjoy Gamepad Tool or DS3 Tool. I downloaded it from MotionEnjoy.com. I will have the link in the description for those who want to download it. Okay, so here we go. Motion Enjoy Gamepad Tool. This is the program itself. I'm just gonna walk you through all the tabs as I usually do. Okay, so let's begin. This is the Profiles tab here, and bas it's basically like the home screen. You were to if you have you would have to plug in your controller and it would appear here and you would have all these modes f to choose from custom mode battery information you can enable it vibration testing game controller panel disconnect all right while i'm on the screen i'm going to show you an example i'm going to plug in uh, a ps3 controller all right All right, as you can see, um, I don't know if you heard that at all. So, the PS3 controller is connected. The light, the the four-player light on the controller is. So you would have to click enable, and it would try reloading the page. Hold on. All right, there you go. You see it, as you can see, it says there, connect to game controllers one, Dual Shock three slash six action six axis Bluetooth, and there you can have. I have the Xbox 360 controller emulator, um, on because I am playing Super Meat Boy. I do have a review of Super Meat Boy if you want to go check that out. I may have the link in the description. I'm not sure, so just when you're just look that up if you want. Okay, so then as I walk you all through all this, this is the driver manager which is ba like this without the driver manager you will not be able to get anything working so you're gonna want to say yes to anything and when it brings up the manager as you can see here it says port number one all this and then motion enjoy loaded already and what this does is when you plug in your PS3 controller for the first time and it you, well, usually when you plug things in for the first time it'll usually start searching for drivers and it'll install them now when you plug in your PS3 controller for the first time, it it, it'll, it will find drivers and install them, but you're going to want these drivers. So you would have to ch check them and then load driver, which I'm not going to do. But, um, and then after that, yeah, and that's it. You would have, um, and also if you want, if you want to put drivers on a Bluetooth dongle to work with the PS3 controller, you would have to plug that in and then load the drivers for that as well. Um, as you can see, roll back, refresh, install all, game controller panel, device manager, uh, Bluetooth pair. This is a very awesome feature that I love and which I use on my, I, which I actually use. Alright, what Bluetooth pairing is, if you have a Bluetooth dongle, you would be able to plug it into the computer. As I said, you would have to use device ma driver manager to load the drivers for it. And after you plug it in, you should have one here. Bluetooth ad adapt, adapt, adapter, what the... I think they misspelled that. Okay, that's a spelling fail. So you would have it plugged in. Then you would take the USB cord and plug your PS3 controller into the computer. Then after that, it will be appearing here. Then after that, you would click pair now. So it would be it would pair the PS3 controller and the dongle together so that when you turn on the PS3 controller and the dongle is attached is plug into the computer it will work without the um the um uh, without having it be connected by USB. All right, language, you know, just self-explanatory languages. Uh Japanese. Yeah. I don't know if it's even here. Or maybe it's one of these, I don't know, but Japanese is there too. Uh I guess if you speak Japanese <coughs> um 
Okay, so this is options, auto run, auto check, update information, placing in uh, whatever, all this stuff, save changes, default, and about, just talks about the um, program license agreement and all that stuff. Alright, so that's basically the program, and um, this, I would definitely recommend this program to you if you have a PS3, don't have a gamepad, con controller that's made for the computer, and just want to play it's it's an awesome it, it really works but, but some negatives that I have about it I don't know about everybody else but some negative things from my point of view that sometimes the PS3 controller just won't sync up to the computer at all it just won't sync um, but to me the solution for that is either to unplug it completely and just wait for the lights to go off and then try it again or to exit out completely the DS3 tool by right clicking here and then um, clicking exit and then trying it again that usually gets it working again for me all right so that's it um like comment subscribe this is super storm trooper signing out uh see you youtube